Well, the IU Credit Union started uh, 60 years ago, 1956. Chancellor Wells was very supportive of having a credit union on the Bloomington campus. At that time, it was formed with just a handful of staff at the university with virtually no capital. As a credit union, the capital is the accumulated earnings of the organization. So as you can imagine, it started with a very modest beginning. It took us 30 years to reach assets of 100 million, and since that time, in the second 30-year period, we've grown to 880 million in assets with over 200 employees in 11 locations throughout the state, and in fact have members throughout the world as associated with the university. When a member walks into the doors of the IU Credit Union, the experience we hope they have is that of a member owner. It's their credit union. We hope that when they leave the organization, they feel like we've uh, interacted in their best interest, that we've watched for them and after them in terms of their financial well-being. We were actually the first institution in this market to offer online banking. Since that time, virtually half our membership is online, and a high percentage of those actually use our mobile app. The majority of our residential real estate loans come through the internet. Communication is the key to engagement of our employees. We inform them monthly as our progress on our business plan, how we're doing. Semi-annually, I meet with all employees, talk about our industry, our organization, how we're doing, our opportunities that are out there for us. I want them to understand, as part of our team, that they contribute significantly to our success and they are critical to serving our membership. We've contributed significantly to every cause in the community. We feel like when the community thrives, the IU Credit Union will as well. I hope what this means to our employees, it's a pat on the back, that we've done well, we've succeeded for our membership, and the fact that we are a valued partner to our members. I think the IU Credit in the next five to 10 years will continue to grow, thrive, uh, reflect our community, which is a very vibrant community. And I think the Credit Union uh, will continue to add technology, will continue to add services, and be a, a tremendous alternative for financial services in this community. I'd like to thank our board of directors and our supervisory committee. They serve as volunteers. They've served as volunteers for 60 years. Those that have served currently and in the past have made a tremendous mark on our organization through their governance, their oversight on behalf of the membership. I appreciate their efforts on an ongoing basis and it's the credit union board and volunteers that have greatly added to our success.